E. E. E buonasera, buonasera a tutti, buonasera. Ciao Vilit, ciao Luke, ciao Morinix, ciao Ark. Vediamo, recupero un po' quello che avete scritto. Mi ero dimenticato del like, come? Come? Ciao Morino, Ark, Vilit. Bravo Luke, bravo Luke, l'ho capita, l'ho capita. Ciao Alice, tutto bene, tutto bene, dai. Dai, questa settimana mi è andata abbastanza bene, mi sono riposato, sono stato contento perché ho ricevuto una bella cosina che vi farò vedere domani pomeriggio in live. Se... Ciao Scalengi, e, se, se mi state seguendo sul canale Telegram, se non lo fate vi invito a farlo, se non lo fate eh, ho postato un po' di immaginette di giochi che vedremo domani su questa nuova console che ho comprato di cui probabilmente vi ho parlato an anno fa an anno x fa e comunque è uscita è, è una console nuova non è retro è nuova messaggi criptici avranno risposta domani esatto esatto e lo spoiler è questo che stronzo che se no va bene e quindi sì, è una console portatile, riuscirò a streammarla tranquillamente perché, come detto, è una console, è una console recente, per cui si può streammare senza problemi, si attacca un cavo al, al PC e va tranquilla. E, e niente, niente, non vedo l'ora di farvela vedere perché è appena uscita, praticamente ci sono già un centinaio di giochi, per cui... Io non so più dove sbattere la testa e vabbè, vedremo domani, vedremo domani. Questa sera vediamo di, di finire. Come suonano bene. Che bel cappello, grazie Motta, Motta Sor, Motta Sor. Comunque, eh, questa sera vediamo di finire Monkey 3, ovvero Curse of Monkey Island, che lo stiamo giocando in uh, italiano sottotitolato ma col parlato in inglese, e la volta scorsa abbiamo visto, o meglio senti abbiamo sentito, che con le voci in inglese è quasi un altro gioco. Ciao C, tu sei bello, tu sei bello. Comunque... Tra poco iniziamo, tra poco iniziamo, volevo dirvi un'altra cosa. Ah sì, settimana prossima, se tutto va come deve, eh, ci saranno i Gabriel Award. Come ho fatto l'anno scorso, come ho fatto l'anno... come ho fatto l'anno scorso? Avevo più tempo l'anno scorso. Come ho fatto l'anno scorso, ho raccolto tutti i giochi usciti per Commodore 64, que eh, questa... Cioè, come ho fatto nel du del 2022, tutti i giochi usciti nel 2022, e... Mm. C'è un, una postilla da fare, perché saranno due serate di Howard, ovvero la prima per i giochi originali usciti nel 2022, e la seconda per i porting usciti nel 2022. Perché i porting usciti per Commodore quest'anno sono veramente tanti e molto validi. E Morenix che riscatta mamma, perché non è arrivato in chat? Non l'ho visto in chat. Che cosa strana. Va bene, eh, arriva subito. Mamma! Ok. E dicevamo... Mi si è rotto Twitch. Tra l'altro mi è apparso adesso nel feed, ma vedo che è stato riscattato un minuto fa. Boh, vabbè. Comunque, eh, ho perso il film. Ah sì, eh, perché effettivamente ho pensato che, dato che i porting sono molto validi, però non hanno l'originalità di essere dei giochi effettivamente nuovi, eh, potevano togliere spazio a giochi che magari meritavano o giochi che comunque sono eh, meritevoli possono togliere spazio a porting ben fatti per cui ho deciso di separare le cose dato anche quello che era successo l'anno scorso anche se è uscito dopo che abbiamo fatto gli award 
è uscito il porting di Sonic per Commodore 64 e avrebbe distrutto tutto. Meno male che è uscito dopo, perché se fosse uscito prima avrebbe praticamente ucciso tutte le categorie, avrebbe vinto di tutto, togliendo spazio a giochi che erano comunque validi. Per cui, dato che quest'anno è uscito un porting molto succoso, anzi più di uno, ma sono usciti anche dei giochi succosi, ho deciso di separarli. Ho fatto Howard il Papa, e lo esatto, esatto. Ma comunque di questo ne parleremo meglio settimana prossima. Direi di cianciare le bande e cominciare. E domani. A posto. <ride> Lo farò spesso stasera. Eh, qua. E siamo esattamente dove eravamo domenica. Ovvero... Osti. Ah. Audio altino. Ok, ovvero ci siamo appena liberati dalla, dalla bara, abbiamo liberato Stan e quindi andiamo a dire che non siamo morti, dai. Hi guys, I guess you'll be wondering how I came to be back from the dead. No questions for the dead guy come back to life? No questions like is there life after death or is there a heaven? Will there be adequate parking? <laughs> Fine. Be that way. I wouldn't tell you about the hereafter if you begged me. E si sente che Dominic Armato qui era ancora acerbo come Guybrush, non gli dà quel quell'impulso che ha dato il nostro doppiatore di cui assolutamente non so il nome, però dov dovrei saperlo. Avrei dovuto saperlo. Chiedo scusa al doppiatore italiano. It says we welcome your tips. Va bene, prendiamo questo barattolo. That jar's for my tips. Put it back. But I was gonna put a whole lot of money in it. Too much for me to carry around with me. So I'm gonna have to take it with me and fill it up. Oh, ok then. Ok. <ride> Opuscoli. It's full of brochures for Big Whoop. The place for pirates and pirates at heart. Ah, prendiamone qualcuno. No? Sì. Ah, sì. Parliamo col tizio. I thought if I died I'd be buried with your aunt. Well, isn't it obvious? You can't be buried in the Good Soup family crypt unless you're a member of the Good Soup family. A member of the family, eh? Huh? Giusto. Uh, come posso raggiungere Skull Island? To Skull Island? Well, there used to be a regular ferry out to Skull Island. Grazie, Willit. Ah, one cold night. So the tale goes, the Welshman set out in his dinghy. The deep fog around Skull Isle obscured even the moon, but the Welshman could see the distant light of the Blood Island lighthouse. When he'd rowed half the distance, the light in the lighthouse was mysteriously smashed, and the poor Welshman was lost, almost never to be seen again. Uh, almost? Well, there are those who say that late at night, If you stare into the fog long enough, you may see the flying Welshman rowing in his ghostly dinghy, lost for all eternity. Creepy. Molto bene. Quindi sappiamo che il diamante dell'anello eh, della famiglia Goodsoup l'hanno rubato, o meglio, è stato venduto ai pirati che si trovano a Skull Island. Per cui dobbiamo raggiungere Skull Island. Per farlo dobbiamo riportare qui il gallese volante e per farlo dobbiamo riaccendere il faro. Mentre l'anello vero e proprio ce l'ha la zia di sto tizio qua che è sepolta nel... Ciao. che è sepolta nella cripta di famiglia. Però giustamente noi siamo <coughs> morti ma non ci hanno sepolto nella cripta di famiglia perché non siamo della famiglia. Quindi dobbiamo diventare della famiglia. Oh, guarda un po'. Guardiamo questi ritratti. Count Gaspacho Goodsoup, the cold-hearted canning magnet. It's the Duchess Cream of Goodsoup, of the Noodle Goodsoups. Noodle Goodsoups, certo, certo. 
questi abitanti qua Peter and Victoria Swa Goodsu, Marquis and Marquess of Consumé. Ok. Minerva Stroheim Goodsu, Baroness of Borscht. Molto bene. Baron C. Lambert Chowder Goodsu, pioneer of crouton technology. He looks a lot like the guy at the bar. Molto bene. It's nailed to the wall. Hmm. Primo doppiatore italiano di Mew e doppiatore ufficiale di Ratchet. Ah, ma oh, guarda. Vecchi ritratti. It's a bunch of old portraits of the Van Salad family, and I thought the good soups were a homely bunch. <ride> Comunque abbiamo qui una mazzetta, qui c'è un chiodo che sporge e quindi lo mazzettiamo. Oh, oh, abbiamo fatto casino. Vabbè, eh, via il ritratto. Hmm. Esatto. Bravo, Gaibash. What? <coughs> ha detto what perché non gli ho detto io di farlo, l'ho fatto in autonomia. Va bene, eh, quindi... Chi è? It's the face that I cut out of the good soup portrait. It's a good soup family portrait, but I've cut out the face. Giusto? E quindi lo mettiamo qua. Perché convenientemente queste porte hanno uno blò. E quindi... There's nothing like family. No matter what may happen in the topsy-turvy world of the Caribbean resort business, I can always relax in the knowledge that I come from good, wealthy stock. Breeding. That's what's important. Breeding and culture. Just like Grandfather Lambert. Breeding. Culture. And lots and lots of really old money. Mm, it makes a man proud. That's funny. I don't remember Grandfather Lambert as looking so... so common. Oh, oh weird. It's like his eyes follow me. Pictures like that really creep me out. Molto bene, ci siamo fatti vedere come, come nonno. Lo lasciamo così? Lo lasciamo così, che ci frega. E qui c'è una bella porta. È chiusa. È laminato, e quindi... I guess I'm better at this pirating thing than I thought. It worked. <ride> Come non si fa ad aprire una porta così? Voilà, e siamo dentro la camera. It looks out over the cemetery. It's creepy. Bello, bello. Oh, un ospite. Ah, mi sono dimenticato di fare una cosa, vero? Sì, mi sono dimenticato. Vabbè, arrivederci. No, eccolo qua. Ecco qua, il chiodino che c'era sul muro. Questo ci serve. Dato che il letto non sta giù. Deficiente Vabbè eh, Ok I'm not sure if that's strong enough to hold it I might need one more nail One more There 
a posto. E quindi vediamo questo caro amico. Wow. Room are hefty by now. Ciao. The Good Soups, a life in pictures by MM Good Soup. Conveniente, una storia di famiglia dei Good Soup. E quindi prendiamo, leggiamo un po'. Cosa dice? Cosa dice? It's full of all the dates and fun facts you'd ever want to know about the Good Soup family. And it says I'll receive a new book every month or cancel with no obligation and keep my copy of Buccaneers and Bouillon Bays as a free gift. Oh, che, che, che bello. Salve. Uncle Griswold, it's me! Don't you recognize me? Recognize you? I've never seen you before in my life. What is your name? Uh, Wonton. Anche bistecca al sangue e patatine non è male come nome. Hearty beef and potato. Hearty beef and potato? I come from good Irish stock. Hmm. I don't recall having any relatives with that name. Look at me. Don't I look just like a good soup? Now that you mention it, you do bear a slight resemblance to my great grandfather, C. Lambert Good Soup. Clammy? Why, folks back home used to tell me all the time. You're the spitting image of old chowder good soup. You know, I think you're right. Really? Oh, I wonder why I didn't see it before. I could just talk about good soup history all day. How about that first fateful journey made to the Caribbean? Oh, you mean the one that... Baron Salmon Bisque the Good Soup began in 1621? Exactly. He landed on Scab Island with just a spoon and a dream. In just four short years, he had formed the largest chain of all soup restaurants in the Western Hemisphere. Sure. By 1635, he had driven the entire Van Salad family out of the Caribbean and had a restaurant empire that spanned the globe. Actually, the Van Salads were not driven out until 1637, and the Good Soup chain of restaurants and resorts never did become popular in the South Pacific. Yes, we are. All right, whatever. Well, son, it looks like you were right. Welcome back to the glorious name of Good Soup. I'm, uh, honored. And as a Good Soup, you're welcome to every benefit the name provides. Instant prestige around Blood Island. A 10% discount at any of the Good Soup resorts in the Caribbean. And, of course... Medical, dental, and a 401k. And the best thing of all, if you should happen to drop dead, you will be buried in the extravagant Good Soup family crypt. Molto bene. It's as if all my dreams have come true. Molto bene. Moltissimo benissimo. Allora, torniamo qua a prenderci un po' di formaggio. Grazie, farmacia, grazie. Voilà. Mm. Mangiare? Nah. Nah. <ride> nah. Va bene. Quindi, se ora moriamo, veniamo sepolti. Ma, 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 prima... Guarda un po'. Mutual of stand. Beh, ufficio caratteristico. It's Stan. Sì, scusa, volevo parlarci. You've convinced me. I want to buy some insurance. A wise choice, and one you won't soon regret. The question isn't whether or not you can afford to buy an insurance policy, it's whether you can afford not to. 
Speaking of which, can you afford to buy an insurance policy? Well, how much does it cost? Oh, that depends on a variety of factors. How much coverage you need, how much you're willing to spend, all sorts of highly complicated sliding scale insurance equations and such. But I won't bore you with all that. Just let me ask you this. How much money do you have? Well, I've got these wooden nickels. Uh -huh. I see. Maybe I've confused you somewhere along the line. While nothing would please me more to send you out of here, with the peace of mind that your family will be provided for in the unlikely event of your death, I have to run a business here. If you can't at least show me some collateral, I can't give you a policy. Equitable. This authentic pirate relic. A genuine tooth from an actual pirate. Only one of its kind. Is that real gold? The finest known to man. Not much spit on it either anymore. Now you're starting to speak my language. All right, let's find oh, really a coverage plan that suits your needs. And you can rest assured that you've provided for your family well after your unfortunate departure. What are the terms of this plan exactly? It's quite simple, son. When you die, whoever holds that policy gets a uh. lot of money. A lot of money? Wow. Wow is right. Now I want you to be careful out there. Okay, I will. Thanks. No, I'm serious. I want you to be very, very careful. Will do. Ecco, questa è una linea di Stan che mi piaceva parecchio in italiano. Ovvero quando dice quando tu muori, gli faceva anche il fischietto e, ed era bellissimo. Era bellissimo come doppiaggio in italiano. E ed era una a quanto pare era un'aggiunta del doppiatore italiano bravissimo bravissimo anche in questo caso e quindi va bene che facciamo moriamo di nuovo ma sì I'd like a drink, coming right up c'è un mischietto e via alla salute A posto. Oh dear. He's had a sudden and completely unexpected relapse of death. Oh. And just as we were getting reacquainted, as his kinsman, it is my duty to give him a proper burial. It is my solemn vow. Young, hearty beef and potato shall be buried in the good soup family crypt. All right. <laughs> Eccoci qua, nella cripta dei Good Soup. <ride> Molto bene. Salve! Una sposa fantasma. È un ghost in un bride's gown. Si sembra molto sad e lonely. Ghirlanda funebre. Tastefully done. Mm, bene. Davvero, Valtir? E parliamoci con la tizia. Oh. <coughs> Salve. Oh, hello there. Who are you and what are you doing here? I am Mini Good Soup, last in a long line of eligible Good Soup debutantes. Oh. I was buried here exactly one week after my wedding day. A wedding day that never came. What happened? I was the belle of Blood Island. How many people can claim that? Oh, how the lads adored me. I was courted by the richest, most handsome men in the Caribbean. But all my suitors bored me to tears. I wanted someone dangerous. I wanted a pirate. By the way, what do you do for a living? <laughs> Boring inspector. Oh. Then one day, Perché già ci stava provando. Eh? I fell for him instantly and we became engaged. But he left me standing at the altar and I died of a broken heart. Wow. That bites. Oh, I know. Ok, non me l'aspettavo, ma la sposa ha l'accento del sud, sud, eh, 
Sud America, Sud, um, Sud Stati Uniti, cioè Texas, quelle parti lì. Ed è strano come l'abbiano reso in italiano, però era reso molto bene. Were there any other suitors you found attractive? Well, there was one I could have fallen for. Young Charles de Goulash. He had such a radiant smile. What happened to him? You know, it's funny. I don't know. He checked into the hotel one night and I never saw him again. Uh -huh. <coughs> <coughs> È il tizio morto nel letto, chiuso nel letto, poveraccio. Well, so sì, sì, me l'hai detto. Scusa. Uh, Ehi, bella nena. Hey, nice ring. Oh. Was it something I said? I hate this ring. It's been passed down from mother to daughter in the good suit family for generations. It was to be my wedding ring until that evil pirate stole the diamond and left me. Oh. Left me here to die of a broken heart. Where's the diamond for your ring? It's gone. He took it. Who took it? My love. My honey cakes. My widow schnubum, my Lechuk. Lechuk is your schnubums? He pried yeah. the diamond from its satin during the rehearsal dinner. Oh, what a fool I was. He told me he was taking it out to get some fresh air. Ah, sì. Normale. <laughs> Since you're, uh... Not using it. Can I have your engagement band? This ring will remain on my finger until I have a wedding band to replace it. Molto bene. How do I get out of this crypt? There's no way out of this crypt for either of us. I don't I don't want this lonely tomb until I've married a man I truly love. And you can't leave because the door's locked. Oh, l'ironia. Uh Go into the light. If only it were that easy. I'm afraid I can never leave this crypt until I marry. Are you attached? Go into the light. L'hanno tradotto con mostrati. Ecco perché non l'ho mai capita com'è. Ah, fanculo. Mostrati. E vai verso la luce, nel senso ascendi al paradiso, non mostra. Cazzo vuol dire mostra? Io ho sempre pensato, non so, vai dai Gutsu, poi fate vedere. Eh, no, <ride> no. Engaged, actually. Oh, what a shame. You sure have pretty eyes. Grazie. Oh. This is just a shade too creepy for me. I'm leaving. Porca miseria. Eh, vedi Vilit. Uh, c'è un buco. Vediamo dove porta questo buco. Hey, there's a hole in the ceiling of this crypt. I Bra. think I might be able to squeeze through. <clears throat> wow, it's a tunnel that opens on a deep, dark forest. It looks familiar somehow. As if I've seen it in a dream. Or maybe it's... Oh, I don't know. Bright jumping monkeys! A terrifying horde of stunningly rendered rabbit jaguars! They're coming right at me! Whew. It's a good thing I couldn't get through that hole. I'd be done for. <laughs> e qui eh, si chiude il cerchio tra l'1 e il 3, perché nell'1, eh, se ricordate, quando si guardava dentro quel... Um, uh, quel tronco diceva che c'era qualcosa ed inserire il dischetto 22 per farcelo vedere un palanchino <ride> sì. This is good soup is food uh -huh. Non 
c'è nessuno qui. Giustamente. <ride> Ciao Mario. I don't want to get caught up in a conversation with Murray right now. Perché no? È bello, è simpatico. Crepa, muori. Uh, c'è il c'è il vecchino. Hey, mister, help. What? Who's there? Who said that? Who's scaring poor old Mort the grave digger? There's been a horrifying mistake. I've been buried alive in the Good Soup family crypt. All right. This joke has gone far enough. You kids should be ashamed of yourselves. It's no joke. I'm really trapped in here. Crazy kids with your long hair and your baroque music. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. This isn't a trick. I'm really trapped in this crypt. I drank a special potion to put me into a coma. Thinking I was dead, they buried me in this crypt. Yeah, right. They did that in the book. Never trade lunches with a corpse. If you kids ever came up with an original idea, I might believe you. Just come and look at me through this crack. Oh, sure. I turn my back to the door and you thieving little hoodlums will sneak up from behind and tie me up. I read all about your sinister ways in my horror novels, so nothing doing. You must love horror stories to own all these collectibles. Reading fantastic stories about the dead helps me keep my mind off my work. Uh-huh. Why are you wasting your money on all this bad fiction? At least my bad fiction doesn't require over a thousand dollars in hardware. Ooh. I see your point. <laughs> Let me out of this crypt. I'm not falling for your tricks this time. Just leave me alone and let me read my horror novels. Curses, you've seen through my web of deceit. I'm no ordinary man trapped in a crypt. Well, what are you then? Uh, la mia nave iperspaziale è intrappolata in un'anomalia subspaziale, certo. Sono in cerca di scettri dorati di Kton per portare la pace nella contea. Uh, sono un fantasma folle e malvagio che infesta questa cripta. Sta venendo queste belle giacche di cuoio. I'm an angry and deranged ghost haunting this crypt. Then let me see you appear before me. Excuse me? If you were a real spirit, you could materialize in a ghostly form. It's all in the books. Eh, certo. Well, let's see it. Isn't the ominous sound of my disembodied voice proof enough? I guess not. <laughs> Fear me. I'm an evil ghost. Then go ahead. Show your ghastly visage. I can't. I'm shy. You're no ghost. I'm going to haunt you until you set me free. Then go ahead. Show your ghastly visage. Not right now. You're no ghost. I'm going to go sulk in the darkness now. Have a good time. Murray. Ho bisogno di te. Alas, I can't use Murray with that. Allora abbiamo un braccio scheletrico. I can't see where the arm is going from here. E gli mettiamo un po' di colla. I can't see where the arm is going from here. What? I've got it. Hey, 
what happened to the light? <ride> Fregata la lanterna, benissimo. Lanterna sulla bara. Eh? Murray? Murray, do your stuff. Ok. Madonna, è bravissimo a fare le ombre cinesi. Come? And never more will you be able to find socks that match. Santo cielo. All right, hang on. I'm coming. Great work, Murray. I I was terrifying, wasn't I? My demonic powers have made me omnipotent. <laughs> <laughs> Va bene. Uh oh, looks like the lantern ran out of oil. There. It's open. Now shuffle off and give me a key. Molto bene, ora possiamo uscire. Salve signorina. Eh sì, i calzini sbagliati sono. Sono la morte. Well, Murray, are you ready to continue our heady adventuring? Murray? Where'd you go? Ho perso Murray. E niente, non c'è più Marri. Hey, what an amazing story I have to tell. I was dead but I live again. Who wants to hear about it? Eh, you guys don't deserve to hear a good story. Infatti. Oh, guarda, un certificato di morte. This hereby certifies that hearty beef and potato good soup met his demise at least once on Blood Island. Pacchela. E ci diceva la, la signorina fantasma che il tizio qua era il suo sparissimante. The Murphy bed is slammed up so many times it's made a hole in the wall. E apriamolo questo buco. Molto bene. Vai va. Fate un viaggetto al cimitero. Hallio! Cazzo ride sto scemo. Vabbè. Exactly the same. Oh, Charles, how you flatter me. Oh, but you must go now. But why? Now that I've found you again after all these years. What would our family say if they knew we were alone together on such a romantic night? Minnie, this may sound rash, but I... I love you, Minnie Good Soup. Oh, Charles, you mustn't. Oh, I can't help it. I've always loved you. Do you hear? I've always loved you, Minnie, and I always will. Romantico. Come away with me now. No. Oh, but Charles, it just isn't done. Think of the scandal it would cause. To heck with the scandal, Minnie. Oh. Marry me. Oh, yes, Charles. Yes. A thousand times, yes. Then kiss me, my love. <ride> stato dietro c'è rimasta secca <ride> fantastico benissimo abbiamo l'anello grazie signori avete visto Guybrush ha anche fatto ritrovare l'amore alla la targa che dice è una memoria per Minnie Stroni Goodsoup 
molto bene nel frattempo da qualche parte sotto Monker Sentite che bella la voce di Le Chuck. In questa l'ho sempre trovata molto eh, cheesy come... Come cosa? Welcome back to Mutual of Stan. Mi spiace Stan. Stan? I'm cashing in this insurance policy. Give me a lot of money. But this is a life insurance policy. You collect when the policyholder dies. No, honest. I was dead for a really long time. And you just got better? Well, yes. Do you have any proof of this miracle? As a matter of fact, smart guy, I've got your proof right here. A death certificate. Well, this must be some kind of mistake. Uh-uh, it's right there in high-res black and white. I died. Give me a lot of money. <laughs> hmm. It looks like I'm left with no choice but to acquiesce. No, just give me my money. That's what I mean. Oh, oh thanks. Ciao, posto. Ciao, Stan. E quindi abbiamo un po' di soldi. This is a lot of money. E a proposito di soldi, io vi ricordo che eh, questi stream fino a domenica prossima sono per eh, raccogliere denaro per la per l'ISM che si occupa della ricerca contro la sclerosi multipla. Stanno o meglio, hanno sviluppato un'app per aiutare la, la diagnosi ed ora la devono immettere sul mercato e tradurre. Per cui donate. Donate, 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 yes. Abbiamo già raggiunto i 200, 200 cosi, 200 money, 220. Ah, 220 abbiamo raggiunto, grazie mille a tutti quelli che hanno donato. Fino a domenica prossima, se volete contribuire, anche con poco... 1 euro, 5 euro, quello che volete c'è tempo torniamo a noi ah 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 mulino a vento prendiamo l'ascensore va Hoppla. E qui c'è un barile. It's full of fermenting sugar water used for making rum. E quindi la mettiamo nel vasetto. Mm. It's full of sugar water now. Molto. Possiamo scendere. Ok. Ok, torniamo un attimo dai good soup Che ci serve un oggettino particolare Ovvero lo specchio Però se ne accorge che manca lo specchio, quindi <coughs> You just stole that mirror, didn't you? No, I didn't It's right there, look Hmm, I guess you're right. Oh dear. 
I'm starting to look old. From all that drinking, mind your own business. <ride> ok fatto lo specchio ora ciao Ellen e... va che belle luccioline allora c'è il coperchio del, del barattolo ci facciamo dei buchini con la forbicella There, e sulipete It's full of yummy, delicious sugar water. Mm, bet that water sure tastes good. Ecco il tappo bucato, così respirano. Voilà. They're trapped inside and glowing like mad. Lanterna. It's full of glowing fireflies. Boy, it's windy up here. Ed ecco qua il faro. La prima volta non ho fatto i buchi, eh, capite a tutti. Perfect. E specchio. The lighthouse is working now. E ora abbiamo il nostro passaggio. Eccolo qua, salve. Il signor gallese volante. Guarda che bel figurino. Col giubbotto salvatano. <ride> Intimidating. Sentiamo. I, I am the lost Welshman. Hmm. Ooh. I am the ferryman between here and Skull Island. Trapped for so very long in the icy ocean mists. Oh, how I hate that blasted mist. Really? I like mist. I think it's pretty. Well, sure, mist is pretty. But egad, is it dull. Never mind. Eh, non ho mai provato a usare Marray con il galese volante. Beh, non puoi usare Marray con il galese volante. Marray lo perdi appena esce dalla cripta. Però potremmo effettivamente usare... Ah no, non ce l'abbiamo più, è vero. Il libro del... Um, del ventriloquismo, niente, va bene. Allora, diciamo... I'd like a ride out to Skull Island, please. I will risk these rough waters no more. Uh, 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 uh. For too long have I rocked that watery cradle of death. Freaky imagery. Whatever. Anyway, I'm not going out there again until I'm sure I can make it there safely. I need a compass. How will being able to draw Bussola. perfect circles get you out to Skull Island? Not that kind of compass. The directional kind. If you find me one, I'll take you to Skull Island. Va bene. E noi, guarda caso, guarda caso, guarda caso, abbiamo qui un'enciclopedia che ci dice... I can only make out page 243. A compass is a magnetized bit of metal floating in a solution. E quindi... Abbiamo dell'acqua. It's full of seawater. Bravo. Spillo che magnetizziamo con la calamita. Cool, magnetic pin. The mind boggles at the possibility. Bravo. Uh, lo infilziamo nel tappo di sughe. Ok. E lo facciamo galleggiare. Voilà. Hey, neat, it points north. Science is fun when you know the secret. A posto, abbiamo una bella. Oh, admit I had my doubts at first, but it looks really nice all put together. Eh, hai visto? Prego, signor Gallese. Here, take this compass. This is a compass? Will it work? Of course. See how it points north? Wow, that's incredible. How'd you do that? Eh, it was nothing. <laughs> e quindi? 
Andiamo a scullare. I'd like a ride out to Skull Island, please. All right, let's go. E quindi Even the bravest of men must dread the Molta attenzione qui. C'è da cagarsi. Steal your courage, boy, now before you gaze upon the terrible, horrible face of Skull Island. That's a duck. What are you talking about? Don't you see the skull? This island doesn't look like a skull at all. It looks like a great big enormous duck. It should be called Duck Island. Well, you see, you, you gotta squint and sort of turn your head and Ooh, it's just so scary. If you squint and turn your head, it looks like a bunny. Well, anyway, see that light up there on the cliff face? That's Smuggler's Cave. It's run by King Andre, the greatest smuggler in the world. And his nefarious assistant, Kruff. But how do I get up there? You'll have to go to the top of the cliff. Won't you be coming with me? No, you must go alone. There will be someone there who will help you. Uh huh. I warn you. Beware of King Andre. He is as ruthless as he is bold. Allora. Luck. Allora. Thanks. Allora. I bet he can help me find the smuggler's cave. Mm -hmm. Hello. Can you tell me how to find the evil smugglers of Skull Island? Beats me. Oh, wait a second. <laughs> Uh, I, I think I remember something about that at the orientation seminar. Let me think. The cave is halfway down this sheer cliff face. Climb on board this dumbwaiter. I'll, I'll lower you down. It looks pretty rickety. Are you sure it's safe? No. Never used it before. But uh, I'm sure it can't be that dangerous. I'm a temp here. The, the usual elevator operator, uh, Braunbeard, uh, he's sick, so I'm filling in. Uh, I guess that'll be okay. What's your name? It's Laput. Preferisco la voce italiana di questo. Would you lower me down to the smuggler's cave? Sure, sure I can do that. You, you must weigh no more than say 20 pounds, right? Actually more like 120. Oh. Well, it can't hurt to try, right? No, you're sure about this. Oh yeah. You don't look that heavy at all. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Is that not tied securely? Here we go. Okay, give me a little bit more slack. Oops. Okay, that's too much slack. Ah! E niente, si vola giù. Che <laughs> bot. A posto? Nessun commento? Vai. Say it looks like a duck. È quello che dico anch'io. Comunque. F te la foot. Allora. Let's try that lowering me down the cliff thing again. All right. I, I think I'm getting better at this. Please be careful this time. No problem. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Andiamo. I got it. I got it. I don't got it. E quella di Kid Capsize. Questa volta quella buona, no? Yet? Do you think you'll be able to lower me down this time? All right. I, I think I'm getting better at this. Here we go. Whoops. E va bene. Si faceva. 
ma ah no dovevo usarlo l'immersione della nave ah ok è vero me lo dimentico sempre sto particolare lo devo usare l'ombrello ovviamente ovviamente non è che lo posso sventolare Just try lowering me one more time. All right. I, I think I'm getting better at this. Here we go. Whoops. Oops. Eccoci. Salve. È spietato tanto quanto è calvo, eh. you guys are supposed to have. Ha, mm. at him, Croft. All right, let me try that again. Good afternoon. I'm the new Skull Island Diamond Inspector. I'm going to have to see every diamond you've got. Every last one. Come on, people. Chop, chop. I don't have all day. I do not like this man. Kill him. Darn. Let me try that again. <laughs> Stand aside or I'll strike you down. I'll strike you down with how polite and reasonable I can be. We seem to have an unwanted visitor, Croft. Deal with him. Darn. Let me try that again. I have got so much money, it's almost embarrassing. Well, hello. Let's talk, Mr. Uh... Van Gorder Fashington. Jethro Van Gorder Fashington. Very well, Mr. Threepwood. Hey, how did you know my... It is my business to know who enters and leaves Skull Island. I am King Andre, and this is my associate Gruff. Were you looking for something in particular? The Good Soup Family Diamond. The Chuck stole it, you bought it, I want it. Now. Please? Sir? Mm -hmm. But we have so much quality merchandise here at the Pirates Club. Our prices get lower every day. Everything a pirate or pirate in training could possibly want is here. For the right price. <laughs> Could you not laugh like that anymore? The Good Soup Diamond is the centerpiece of my collection. The fantastic energy flowing through it is the key to all my power. So, can I have it? Of course you can't have it. Unless you were to give me something in return. Do you expect me to talk? No, Mr. Threepwood. I expect you to buy. <laughs> that diamond belongs in a museum. Exactly. So do post-impressionist paintings, Mr. Threepwood. So do post-impressionist paintings. What the heck is that supposed to mean? One day, you will understand. Your evil plan will never work, Andre. But it is flawless. A carefully placed series of charges laid throughout Blood Island, all controlled by a network of satellites in geosynchronous orbit. Pardon? And only one man has access to the master switch. Of course. I am that man, Threepwood, and... Boss? Yes, Mr. Croft. Ixnay on the evil lamp play? Ah, yes, of <laughs> course. <laughs> Benissimo. You're a madman. Am I mad? Am I? <laughs> Is it madness to sit in a cave at the top of a deserted island, accumulating vast amounts of gold and jewels and stuffed animals, stockpiling plunder from across the Caribbean and passing the savings on to you? Is that madness or genius? Good point. I take it back. I'm not crazy. My prices are. Maybe we could make a deal. As you wish. You are a formidable opponent, Mr. Threepwood, but it looks as if our game of cat and mouse must cease. It is a perfect diamond, one of the largest I've ever seen. 
I'll take it. And so it comes with a very large price. Yeah, enough with the hard sell. How much? It will cost you an awful lot of money. Do you have that much? Well, I have a lot of money. <laughs> Not enough. My partner is right. We can't give it to you for anything less than an awful lot of money. But Chet. perhaps we can make a deal. My partner and I are very fond of cards. Uh, poker in particular. How about a little wager? If you can defeat us at poker, you win the diamond. Sounds fair. Yes. Fair. <laughs> <laughs> Could you stop laughing like that? It's very unnerving. Mm -mm -mm. So, Mr. Threefoot, the question is do you care to join us in a game of cards? Sounds fun. Deal me in, Baldy. You will have to pay to enter the game. Well, how much do I need? Not very much. Sure, I can handle that. This is a lot of money. I better only give them part of it. Have you ever played poker before, Mr. Threefoot? No. Would you believe this is my very first time? Mm -hmm. <laughs> then I'll give you a brief explanation. The game is the simplest variety of five card start. I deal five cards to each of us. We show our cards to each other, and the player with the best hand wins. Well, how do I know what makes the best hand? If you have any questions, just ask us. You do trust us, don't you? Uh, quanto di una vipera visci do malvivente? Fidarmi, scordate lo schifoso fuggiato. Io credo che tu sia la feccia della sua terra. Tu non sai cosa significa fiducia, ladro. Certo. Take a moment to look at your cards. Sì. Leaving so soon, Mr. Threepwood? No. I was just stretching my legs. I want to keep playing. Hmm. 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 I've got a really terrible hand. Apparently, good fortune is not in the cards for you. Eh, no. <laughs> I thought we agreed you weren't going to laugh like that anymore. I have a full house. Aces over kings. You lose. Would you care to try again? No. You bet. I'm going to win that diamond. Put up your side of the wager, Mr. Threepwood. Very well. Let us begin. Come on, seven. Take a moment to look at your cards. E va bene. Noi abbiamo delle carte tutti quali. Five of a kind. Right there. Not even you guys can beat five of a kind. You're correct, Mr. Threepwood. We cannot beat five of a kind. The question remains, however, whether or not you can beat a pair. A pair? A pair of murderous smugglers. Huh? Us, Mr. Threepwood. I'm talking about us. We're gonna kill you. Oh, I get it. <laughs> whether or not you can beat a pair, that's pretty clever. Now, now, gentlemen, let's not be too hasty. There's a delivery man out here with a package. You idiots! You blew out the light! I got the diamond. Not for long, you little... Oh, it's him, not me, you cretin! Who are you calling a fool? There he goes! Get him! Got what I needed from the smugglers. Good. Let us leave this place of evil. There's just one thing I need to do first. Mm -hmm. Really? What's that? Who's there? Oh, it's just you. Wait! What are you doing? Help! Help! Ah! Eh. Eh. Ci sta. A posto. Of your adventures, Guybrush. What? You can't mean. I'm afraid so. This work is too dangerous for me. I'm going to find a more stable, secure line of work. I hear there's still an opening for a chef on Scab Island. Mister. Well, you'll be sorely missed. I know, but my destiny lies out there, somewhere. Beyond the rolling waves. Farewell, good friend Welshman. Oh, wait. 
What'd you say Scab Island was again? East by Northeast. You can't miss it. Huh, thanks a bunch. Ah, whoops. I forgot to tell him that a magnetized pin will only have compass-like properties for a short time. Oops. E niente, quindi abbiamo anello, abbiamo diamante. Ora ci manca solo un modo per togliere l'anello a Ellen. Dimmi Duke, cosa? Cosa? Sono perso qualcosa? Ho preso il mare, sì, l'ho fatto la volta scorsa. They're on Blood Island, sir. Hit them. Ok. E quindi abbiamo il nostro bel anello. Togliamogli questo anello maledetto. Via, via, via. via. Grazie. That ring is really stuck on her finger. E quindi ci serve qualcosa per... Smondarlo. Abbiamo, in effetti... Lo schiuma da barba dal capitano Nick, magari. E quindi ci serve la pozione che diceva... Questo qua. La pozione unta e grassa per le mani. E per averla noi dobbiamo dargli un qualcosa che sostituisca il catrame per riparare la nave. Scusate un secondo. Ah. Così. Ed ecco qua. Siamo al villaggio dei cannibali. Loro dicevano di aspettare un ospite. Eccoci qua. Facciamo finta di essere un ospite. Finally, you're here. Come on, we're late for the sacrifice. God of the volcano who resides in Mount Acidopolis. Accept this sacrifice we make unto you. In the form of flesh with high amounts of fiber and wholesome cellulose. Free of all fat and trans fatty acids. So that it might nourish you and bring your favor upon our humble village. And not upset nor agitate your ulcerative caldera. Okay, boys, toss them in. You've been a wonderful audience, thank you and good night. E via con le tofolette. <ride> Marshmallow cotta al vulcano, secondo me. Mm -hmm. Mm, do you feed the volcano mannequins made from vegetables? Yes, we do. Sherman isn't a strict vegetarian, but fatty foods can cause him severe indigestion. Oops, diamogli un po' di formaggio. cheese to a lactose intolerant volcano god do you know what oh. that means you brought about the coming of the divine dysentery run for your lives la divina dissenteria Divina dissenteria è un bel wow, termine in effetti. Molto bene, abbiamo fatto defluire della lava. Wow. Explosive diarrhea. Però divina dissenteria è più poetico. E 
qui abbiamo un bel barbecue alla lava e quindi se gli mettiamo del nacio a posto I guess I'll just drag this down to Haggis now. Here, Haggis. This stuff should work to patch up the ship. Aye, laddie, indeed it should. The consistency of the sure arc. What could a tangy pepper taste? So, can I have your lotion now? Aye, lad. Go ahead and take it. Molto bene. Abbiamo la lozione. E usiamola sull'anello. Let's see if this slippery greasy lotion does the trick. That should do it. The cursed ring exploded. Molto. Mettiamo l'anello buono. Meritato. Are you all right? Guybrush? Web? Where are we? You're okay. We're on Blood Island. LeChuck's ring had a terrible curse on it, but I put everything right. You're safe and everything's gonna be fine. Just fine. Mm -hmm. Il bacio della scimmia ragno. E ora stiamo aspettando tutti quella. Linea some terrible nightmare. It was no mere nightmare, Guybrush. Search your feelings. You know it to be true. Oh no. It can't be. But it is. This is the Carnival of the Damned. Aye. The Carnival of the Damned. You fiend. Why have you brought us here? There be two reasons, you pathetic privateer. I be intended to torture and kill ye. And I'll be given Elaine a treasure. Certo. Ah, you're wasting your time, LeChuck. Elaine's love can't be bought. Ah, but this be a very special treasure. This be the fabled treasure of Big Whoop. Big Whoop? Aye, the very pirate treasure you were searching for before I caught up with you. What's so special about the treasure of Big Whoop? Isn't it just like any other pirate treasure? Uh -huh. I see. Ye do not yet know the dreadful power that be Big Whoop. I guess not. Quake in fear, Threepwood, when I tell thee that Big Whoop be a damned portal to a demon netherworld. Okay. The treasures okay. of Big Whoop be the very gates of hell themselves. Yay. But how will Big Whoop make Elaine love you? Elaine shall pass through the hoary gates of Big Whoop, just as I once did, down to the inky blackness of the infernal nether regions. Sure. For you see, Big Whoop gives those who pass through it the greatest gift of all, immortality. But at what cost? Cost? <laughs> Granted, the people may find me a bit unapproachable no. now, and the smell does take a while to get used to. But it be worth everything now that I have the power to make Elaine love me. Certo. Elaine will never marry you. She loves me. She does not. She loves me. Nuh-uh. She loves me. Does not. Anyway, Elaine really loves me. Does not. Does too love me? Does not. Does too infinity. Does. Uh, ah! Curse you and your diabolical debate skills. Chat. Sure. 
Dai, facciamo la fine. Let's get this over with. But there'll be so many more horrible things I'd be wanting to tell you. I'm not listening to you anymore. See, I'm ignoring you. Ah, you'd better listen. La 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 la, I can't hear you. La 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 la. Very well, Freeport. If you're going to act like a child, I'll help you get in the mood. I think you deserve a time out, young man. I regret nothing. Molto bene. <laughs> It's not luck. Your plan was flawless, LeChuck, except for one minor detail. That will be your downfall. He's taking Elaine on his roller coaster of death. I gotta reach her before she becomes his undead bride. What's happened to me? Dead, foggy, can't think. I'm swimming. Must concentrate and rescue Elaine. I got to save Elaine. But how can I save Elaine when I'm just a little boy? If only I could think straight. Must clear my mind. <laughs> Welcome to the Big Whoop Carnival, little guy. Come on over here and meet your old pal Dingy Dog. Oh, for crying out loud. Quindi si vuole schiarire le idee. Eccoci, eccoci. Vediamo un po'. Punto esclamativo coni e vediamo com'è in originale. What kind of snow cones do you have? <laughs> What kind of cones did you ask? Why, I have every kind imaginable. I have the most distinct type of snow cones in the world. In fact, my cones are so original, so inventive, and so <laughs> <laughs> unique. The most are completely inedible. Let me list some for you. I have sweet cones, meat cones, cold cones, mold cones, bold cones with lime, cones with slime, <laughs> veggie cones, wedgie cones, edgy cones. I used some of my neighbor's edge in that one. Cones with spice, cones with lice, berry cones, carry cones, fairy cones, and the Christmas, oh, 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 merry cones. So, what do you think of that? Ok. 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 Non mi dispiace. Non mi dispiace. Non mi dispiace. I'd like a plain snow cone, please. Ok, kid. Bye now. Preferisco la voce italiana. Però E l'ha fatta più annoiata E eh, la faccia è giusto annoiata Ok Bambino Ciao Vabbè Vabbè Oops, my snow cone melted Eh, pazzo Ciao Murray Yo, Murray. Hey, it's you. Are you dead yet? You look different. Not dead, Murray. Just cursed. Cursed? That's perfect. I'm cursed too. Let's join our cursed forces together. <laughs> And together we can rule the world. <laughs> yeah. Let me get back to you on that. This anchor looks good, heavy, and useful. Rattone. Cute. A grotesquely enormous smelly rat. Get your mouth away from that cannon, kid. It's dangerous. Ah, io volevo parlare con te, però. Yeah, kid, what is it? What are you guys doing here? 
It's blow the man down, the most fun in the midway. Hit the funny clown and win a fantastic prize. Watch the pies fly from the cannon with blinding speed and loud report. And if your aim is true, go home with your winning. Join in the laughs with your happy sailor host, Warfrat, and his pal, Monty Moran. What flavor? What? What flavor are the pies today? I don't know. Lemon meringue, I think. What kind of a stupid question is that? Molto bene. Meringue al limone. I want to shoot the cannon. I want to shoot the cannon. Sorry, little boy. You're too young. Blow the man down is for older kids. That's discrimination. How do I know it really works if I can't see it go off? Okay, kid. You want to see the cannon fire? Here we go. Ha ha. Ha ha. Ha ha. How can I win one of these fabulous prizes? Well, that's easy, <laughs> matey. If I can't guess your weight or your age, you get to pick what you want. What's the catch? <laughs> There's no catch. It's just that easy. I'll bet you can't guess how old I am. <laughs> bet you I can. A little fearsome buccaneer like yourself must be seven years old. Ha! Wrong. I just so happen to be 20. <laughs> well, you have any proof for your old pal Dingy Dog? You calling me a liar? <laughs> you bet I am. <laughs> I have my proof right here. Scum Actors Guild <laughs> membership card. Guybrush Threepwood, age 20? I suppose you're right. <laughs> Pick your prize. Cannon, con il netto, il teschio parlato. I really want that talking skull. We will rule the world. You're right, Murray. If I had all that power, the temptation for evil would be too great. I'll take the anchor. Well, take it away, son. Congratulations. Enjoy your stay here at Big Blue. Look into your heart. I'm the prize you really want. Prendo more. I like the guy, but this is getting ridiculous. Free me, my brother, and together we can rain terror across the land. My brother? Murray? I'm not speaking to you. How could you pick that anchor over your best friend? Come on, pick me. Uh, uh, you know I'm the best toy on the... What? You picked the anchor? Well, it's a really nice anchor, Murray. Sorry. I can't believe you picked that stupid anchor instead of me. Uh -huh. What good is a dumb hunk of iron anyway? Hey, what do you think you're doing? I just want one of those pies. Yeah? Well, I just want out of this stinking rat head. Life's tough, kids. Cope. Stay away from those. It's not even a real anchor. I'm a real talking skull. I can't go back there. I'm deathly afraid of mimes. After all we've been through. Il terrore dei mimi, certo. Fine. Take the stupid anchor. Yeah. Now that's not very nice, little boy. Yeah. Come on now, stop hitting your pal Dingy Dog. Yeah. I'm not gonna warn you again, kid. Uh -huh. You would have made a lousy undead monster anyway. <laughs> you better cut that out. Yeah, you're really starting to bug me, kid. I'm going to wait for an all right. <laughs> that does it. You're going down, little punk. Ow, he bit me. Hey, give me back that hair, kid. You're ruining the suit. Ok, ho preso il pelo del cane che mi ha morso. Qui c'è del pepe. If 
you value your life, mere mortal, you will flee before Murray, scourge of the living and uber skull of the underworld. Bravo, bravo, Mor. Allora, ci mettiamo una bella schiuma da barba nella teglia. I've got a pipe hand full of shaving cream. E la ancora dentro. E la mettiamo qua. What are you doing over there? I found this pie, mister. Huh? Oh yeah, thanks, kid. Shoot it, shoot it. Not right now. Oh, but I want to see the cannon fire. Beat cheeks, half pint. Look, man, I pay your salary. You want me to tell the chuck you've got unhappy kids running around here? Okay, okay, you little. Ole. Did you just hear something? No. Weird. Maybe it's the acoustics of that smelly giant head. Shut up, kid. E il mimo è stato trascinato via. Da non si sa cosa, però è stato trascinato via. Ciao, sono un good soup. Yoo-hoo, stinky Mr. Rat. Hey, get out of there, you little punk. What are you gonna do about it, vermin boy? This will teach you. Molto bene. E quindi abbiamo l'uovo che è contenuto nella meringa. Frank Pa, grazie mille per il follow. E anche a Iam Only Luke che mi ha seguito un'ora fa, ma non ho sentito niente. Chiedo scusa, grazie per il follow. Uh, tieni il cono fradicio, ti è, zio. Uh. Me ne dai uno nuovo, però. I'd like a plain snow cone, please. Ok, kid. Bye now. E quindi. Uovo. Pelo di cane. E pepe. Gnam. Pepper helps, though. Brain Freeze non è mi gira la testa. Ma che cazzo. Oh, la. Guybrush se la cava ancora. Che non è proprio Kicks Bat once again, però vabbè. Ah, fanculo. Ma allora... Sei Aram Benjo? Come? Qual è il termine italiano di Brian Freeze? In effetti... Mal di testa da gelato? Non, non credo ci sia un termine. Propriamente. Vabbè. Oh no, che palle. Certo. Come hai visto lei? Sei proprio scemo, eh. Uh. Um. No. No, qui non dovevo scendere, ma porca miseria. Vabbè. Io dico, mi si è congelato il cervello. Eh, sì. In pratica, sì. Ok. 
Ciao le Chuck. Ho dovuto fare dire io. E quindi anche questo gioco finisce sulle montagne rosse. O meglio, su un parco di divertimenti. Ok, ci andiamo qui. C'è Herman Tutrut. Il tizio impiccato nel laghetto. La scimmia tre teste. Abbiamo preso della corda. Qui pigliamo del rum. I quattro tizi che avevano i pezzi di mappa. Rum Roger. ci serve una ampolla di olio guarda, guarda Wally che, che è realistico che è ciao Wally ti libero mmm un po' oh no è la Chuck ai Freakwood sarebbe me il tuo peggior nightmare You'll be sorry you ever set foot here on Monkey Island when I'm through with you. Non ci hai portato tu, stronzo. Uh oh. E va bene. E intanto abbiamo tutto quello che ci serve, quindi mitigiamo la corda con l'ampolla di olio. La mettiamo nella botte. Però davvero questo non capisco cosa, cosa c'entra col gioco, questo scimmione, però ok. Voilà. Siamo pronti. Forza le Chuck Forza le Chuck Chuck Forza le Chuck Ecco sì. A te Boom, cut così. Auguri a figli pirata, esatto. your arch nemesis Murray. Mark my words, I shall return to haunt you. Do you hear me? I shall return. <laughs> This is so unfair. <laughs> Allora non serviva agli ammutinati per tornare a casa? Sì Ma loro erano su un'altra isola C'è proprio stato un salto temporale Il 
questa, quest'ultimo pezzettino di, di Monkey 3 proprio non... Mi sa di sbagliato, non, non so. Effettivamente, ness- a parte il primo, nessun Monkey Island ha un finale giusto. <ride> Però, boh... Oh sì, sì, dillo pure, Art. Oh no, l'ultimo... Mm. Sì, sembra proprio tagliato con, con l'accetta, Valtir, eh... Non spiega perché in quella, in quella giostra ci fossero le scene dei, dei vari Monkey Island. Non spiega il perché dello scimmione, che cazzo c'entra. E boh, sconfiggi le Chuck. Pum, finito. Una scena, via. Quest'ultimo pezzo ricalca sul finale del secondo. Sì, ma no. Nel senso che ti lascia un po' aperto a più interpretazioni. Più o meno. Il secondo era molto più criptico. Questo no, questo dice, boh, si sono sposati, The Chuck è morto ma dice che tornerà, boh, basta. Comunque sul finale del secondo ci torniamo quando giocheremo a Return to Monkey Island, che non sarà settimana prossima, ma vediamo se è quella dopo. Scusate se continuo a sbadigliare, ma come sapete... <coughs> La stanchezza è parte di me. <ride> Domani questo, eh. Sto aspettando la fine dei titoli di coda perché c'è un... Int. Ma quindi saltiamo e anche... Eh sì. Sì, sì, sì. Non ne ho proprio voglia. che parte di te se ti svegli alle 5 mi sembra giusto che sono. magari alle 5 <ride> siamo Ringraziamenti molto speciali a George Lucas, certo. E mo, e mo, c'è un piccolo dedicato alla memoria di Brett Barrett. Non ecco. carnival è great, Dad. It sure is, son. But you know, rumor has it that the man who built this place is buried here. And they say that to this day his frozen body remains in the tunnels somewhere beneath the amusement park. Oh. E si è chiuso il gioco A posto A posto Citazione Walt Disney Esatto 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 Perché come detto più volte Aspettate che mi 
come detto più volte Monkey Island è ispirato alla giostra pirata dei Caraibi che c'era a Walt Disney World prima che facessero i film e poi bla 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 bla, bla. per cui sì eh, ci sono un sacco di citazioni a parchi di divertimenti a tema Walt Disney eccetera eccetera E quindi, e quindi, direi che possiamo chiudere anche 20 minuti prima e non succede niente, no? Mm, ok. Noi ci vediamo domani con questa cosa qui che è stata sopra la mia testa per tutta la live. Tutto questo. E, e niente. Voi passate una buona serata, dormite bene, riposatevi perché domani ci aspetta qualcosa di epocale sto creando hype per un cazzo <ride> domani si fa esercizio fisico io soprattutto buonanotte a tutti grazie mille per essere passati a domani e ricordatevi l'ISM ok? a domani